ich muss sagen, mein Herz schlägt ein bisschen schneller, gerade mein Nerd-Herz äh, blüht jetzt gerade auf, weil ich habe hier zwei wunderbare Leute sitzen, äh, die äh, ja, hier heute da sind für die Serie Der Devil, die äh, auf Netflix äh, zu sehen ist und äh, das ist zum einen äh, Steven S. Knight, äh, der Autor, Produzent und auch Regisseur der Serie und der Hauptdarsteller, ja, er spielt ähm, Matt Murdock aka Der Devil, Charlie Cox. Thanks for having And, us. Uh, what I want to know, how did you learn playing a blind man, Charlie? So, um, Last time I saw uh, an actor playing a blind man was uh, Anchorman uh, 2, Will Ferrell, uh, you know? Uh, like, uh, <laughs> where's, uh, yeah. where's my water? Help me! Yeah. So, that's not the kind of way you want how to play did, a blind man. How did you know that that was all my research? No, oh, okay. <laughs> Um, no, so what? So uh, you know, it's it's tricky. I, I, I you know, um, uh, I re the first thing I thought of was Al Pacino in Scent of a Woman. Yeah. You know? um, but it, again, that's slightly different. That's some, that's someone who has gone blind later on in life and is and is you know very much struggling to kind of come to terms with that. Um, it's very it's a very tricky skill set actually, mm -hmm. and um, and you know I worked very closely with a gentleman called Joe Streche, a, a man who's been legally blind for 20 years, and mm -hmm. uh, you know I I spent a lot of time filming him and and asking him all sorts of questions and learning what did it how did it how you walk with a cane and how you read braille, um, and uh, and just also just making sure that. The, that when when I don't wear my glasses or the mask isn't on, that that my eye, there is a deadness to the eyes that they're not the eyes aren't working. But it's so much. it's not just staring in the emptiness. No, oh. it's not. It's 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 because mo a lot of people who ha who are visually impaired will still engage their eye muscles just in order to to um, um, entice you to kind of uh, um, engage with them on a you know practically. So mm -hmm. it, it's it's a lot of little tiny things like that, details that, you, that I talked about and worked on, and and hope that it, it uh, you know, um, hope that it would translate well. Because of course the other thing about Matt Murdock is he is blind, but it's also it's kind of an illusion because he can operate, you know, better than a sighted person. And uh, now let's uh, see some questions. I ask uh, people, hey, you're coming today. Do you have questions? Yeah, and uh, let's look uh, at the first question from uh, Tarek Terry. Who was the person you had the most fun on set? Did you have fun on set? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, it's yeah, it's yeah. such a dark <laughs> series. I don't know. Are you crying? <laughs> yeah. Um, I, yeah. God, that's a good question. I yeah. mean, I have to say Rosario Dawson is a is a really fun person okay. to be around. She's yeah. very, very funny and she has a very dry sense of humor and you know, she she brings such a kind of fun energy to 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 the set that uh you know, she had everyone laughing all the time, you know. So she was great. I had a really good time with her. And yeah. Vincent D'Onofrio was always making me laugh. Yeah, was when I was on it. Really? Uh, yeah, oh, I mean that's, he's that's good to know. That's good to uh, know. You know, he's a big imposing guy, yeah. but he had such a great energy and he was telling stories and laughing and, yeah. and just a uh, yeah. really fun guy. Uh, let's go to the second question. And uh, that's uh, from a man, um, he's a big nerd, yeah, he's a big Marvel fan and he is uh, a German rapper, yeah? He, he told me, dude! Okay, and the second <laughs> thing... Alter. <laughs> Alter, yes. I, ask him. On a scale from uh, one to Ben Affleck, <laughs> how much did you hate the dead of the movie? <laughs> I always uh, defend the movie that, you know, mm -hmm. everybody does a movie with the best intentions. And of course. I'm always shocked that anything good ever gets made because, mm -hmm. honestly, the odds are against you. And yeah. I think there's some incredibly talented people in that movie. And uh, I, I, I'm a big Ben Affleck fan. Um, I thought he did some, some really good work in the movie. And the movie's from a different time, you know. It's, it's pre... Yeah pre-Nolan, pre-what happened with uh, The Dark Knight that really kind of changed the landscape. Mm -hmm. um, and, uh, you know, I, I, I thought everybody gave it their all. And, you know. Yeah, I don't know why every, everyone is against Ben Affleck. I think he's, he's a very good director. Yeah, I, I think he's, he's a and great since, actor and a phenomenal yeah. director. Yeah, and I think since Gone Girl, he, I would say he's a very good uh, um, actor. Yeah. He was he was before yeah. of course but yeah. Ganga was for me the film where I said yeah, yeah. he's good he's I, good I'm personally very excited to see what he does as uh, as Bruce Wayne yeah. Oh yeah. yeah me too yeah, yeah. So uh, the last question uh, are you working on season two 
Not currently. We, Not currently. We will be yeah. um, at some point, but I, I, I don't know what the dates will, will be for that. But uh, it's in the pipeline. We're going to start, I guess that they're, they're going to start putting together some sort of a story and start writing the show, and then, mm -hmm. and then I'll get a phone call. Steven, are there some ideas in your head right now for the second season? I unfortunately won't be back for season two. Okay. I have a, a previous commitment uh, for mm -hmm. a feature film. Um, but the show's in great hands. Uh, two of my writers from season one, Doug Petrie and Marco Ramirez, mm -hmm. who worked on the show, are taking over. And everything I've heard about it, I, I'm very excited to see it. I think it's going to be a fantastic season. Thank you very much for being here. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. Thanks so much for having us. That was really fun.